Hey guys, in this video, I'm going to show you how to use your hanger. Before we get into this video, I'd like to let y'all know that uh, I'm doing a giveaway for the Drake Cutter. In order to participate, all you have to do is be subscribed and leave a comment in any video between now and the end of September. Let's continue. So once you get to the space bar, right, you go, you don't use the ASOP terminals at that location, but you go to the elevator and just select yours. Uh, I will say your name and then the size of your hanger and then hanger. Okay, so you click that, it'll bring you here. And uh, once you're here, you're introduced with uh, a set of terminals here. So this one is what you'll use to hang, um, call your ships and vehicles. And this one will be for your item um, access, personal item access. We'll do a separate video for this. Okay, so uh, in terms of this one, um, what I suggest, if you have small vehicles or anything like a rover, anything like that, I suggest you call those up first because you will have some spaces uh, to park these vehicles or even smaller ships. You have like a Pisces, you can park them on the sides just to keep them there whenever you need them. Okay, so um, what I'm going to do is, so to use it, you interact with this and then you call whatever vehicle you want to call. Okay, so for example, let me call an arrow. It's easy to store this on the side. So I'm gonna call an arrow real quick. Get back. Let me, I think I need to, yeah. I needed to exit out of it in order to get the retrieve option. So now once you hit retrieve for that vehicle now, it will, the elevator will go down and call for your uh, vehicle, whatever vehicle you just call, okay? It'll take a few seconds. So now depending on the largest size of vehicle that you own will determine the size of the hangar. For, for mine, right now in game is uh, I own a Carrick, so I got the large size. If you own something like an 890 or a Reclaimer, you'll get the extra large. And uh, if you have a medium sized ship as your largest ship, then you'll get a medium sized hangar. So this is how it works, for, at least for now. Hopefully CIG will give us the options to, up to upsize or upgrade our hangers uh, in the future. Okay, so now my arrow is being called up. This is just the coolest thing. Okay, once it's, uh, so while it's being called, do not enter into it when that warning sign is up, that red warning sign. Um, Cause if you do, then it will despawn you. I don't know where it takes you, but it will despawn you probably and take you back to where I was. Okay. So here's my arrow, right? So if you have any smaller ships, you can take them out like this easily and put them on the side so if you want to use them as like a parasite ship you can do that okay i don't know what i'm hearing i think i'm hearing other people's hangers i think that's what that sound is so what i'm gonna do so i'm gonna let this off so if you have like a small rover or a vehicle you can do this okay i'll put this one over here actually i have space right here and then I can put park it right here. So vehicles, small ships. You can park them here and they will stay here. And they will stay here. Okay. So so now if you want a second, if you want now to call a bigger ship, then you would do it. Once you call that bigger ship, uh, you can call it and then you can put your parasite ship on top of it or land rover or hovercraft whatever whatever you have right there's there's also there's spaces for these things like i would put like a small rover here or a hovercraft in here um have another space for like a small ship here i could put some smaller items in this area um yeah so you can see i put some stuff here some decorative things and uh so that is the piece where 
Uh, so now, if I wanted to call a bigger ship, then I'll do this. I'm going to call my Carrick. So now, my Carrick, what I did was I already put a Pisces inside of my Carrick. So you can do stuff like that, which is really cool. So now, while we're doing this, we're going to interact with the freight elevator, right? So you can see I already have some stuff here. I'm going to, uh, if I had a multi-tool, I'll be able to just pick them up, which I did earlier and uh, put them anywhere, really. What I did was I put some over here, as you can see there, right there, right? So um, I don't have a multi-tool with me right now, unfortunately, but the way to interact with the uh, your warehouse is you come to this terminal right here, it looks just like this and you interact with this terminal so you have to lower it right now it's up right you can see that my stuff is up right there the elevator is up so lower it now it will transfer anything that's there to the warehouse so now it's supposed to see the items that's currently sitting on it, but it doesn't seem like it's showing it, right? So if you want to grab some stuff from your warehouse, now that it's lowered, all you have to do is drag and drop these items, okay? So let's say, for example, this gun, all right? Now that it's here, all you have to do is hit up. I hear somebody's vehicle driving around in their hangar. Unless it's one of my org mates that just joined my hangar. Yeah, that's one of the things that you need to know. If you're in a party with your org mates, they can just join your hangar and just come in and start also operating in here. As long as they're in your party, okay? So now I brought my gun. So now you can see my gun is right here. Now that I brought it back up, I also have to get a multi-tool and move the rest of my stuff here. So uh, then you can grab it and put it anywhere you want to store your stuff. Okay, so that's essentially how that works. Um, so now, for example, as you can see, my Carrick, which is my mothership, has my Pisces in here already. I already put my Pisces in here. You can see my arrow is also here. If I ever wanted to put the arrow on top of the Carrick, which I believe I can do, um, but I'm not going to do that right now. Um, so items like, where is it, where is it, where is it, where is it? Like tables, chairs um, that you can get. You can also place them on your ships and take them with you as long as it's on, uh, on a flat surface, I believe. Okay, so you can literally use a multi-tool and grab them and put them on your ship. So I did, I think I did one recently with the Carrick. So this is a good test. This would be a good test to see if it if it's if it kept the my Carex, uh the, the chair that I put in my character. Yes, it did. Isn't that awesome? Look at this. Isn't that awesome? Isn't that awesome? Right. That is that's just the coolest thing. All right. So uh, this is essentially what I wanted to show you guys: just how to use your hanger, how to get yourself a familiar, and some of the things that you can do. Um, oh, got another freight elevator right here too. I got two of them actually right over there as well. Nice. So you can have a friend, I guess, using this one. And I guess they would be able to get stuff from their freight elevator, from their warehouse. And while you use yours with this one, that's actually pretty cool. That's pretty cool. Okay. Uh, you guys let me know your thoughts. Uh, on some of the concepts that we just covered. If you have any questions, let me know in the comments down below. Before I let you go, I'd like to let y'all know that my organization, Phase One Industries, is now recruiting new and better employers. If you are interested, you can find our Discord in the description down below. Don't forget to leave a like, subscribe. Catch you guys on the next one. Peace.